hello welcome to park Mess. in this video we will be learned at how can we solve this nice olympiad math questions so let's start the video first of all we will write solution and we will rewrite this question in solution again so let's start 2 raised to power x plus 3 is equal to 3 raised to power x plus 2 now in the next step we will use an exponent formula here that formula is a raised to power m plus n is equal to a raised to power m into a raised to power n so this equation will become 2 raised to power x multiply 2 raised to power 3 is equal to 3 raised to power x multiply 3 raised to power 2 now we will divide both sides by 3 raised to power x by 3 raised to power x similarly this term also by 3 raised to power x and similarly we will divide these two terms by 2 raised to power 3 so it will become 2 raised to power 3 so here these two terms will be cancelled and on the left hand side these two terms will be cancelled so only implies 2 raised to power x divided by 3 raised to power x is equal to 3 raised to power 2 divided by 2 raised to power 3 <coughs> in the next step from left hand side we will take x as common so it will become 2 divided by 3 whole raised to power x is equal to 3 raised to power 2 divided by 2 raised to power 3 now in this step we will take log on both sides so it will become implies log of 2 divided by 3 whole raised to power x is equal to log of 3 raised to power 2 divided by 2 raised to power 3 so here this is will be come here by using log formula this log formula log of m raised to power n is equal to n and log of m so by using this log formula we can write this left hand side as implies x into log of 2 divided by 3 is equal to this side will be the same log of 3 raised to power 2 divided by 2 raised to power 3 as we need to find the value of x so we will eliminate log of 2 divided by 3 from this side so we will divide both sides by log of 2 divided by 3 so it will become log of 2 divided by 3 and also divide this by log of 2 divided by 3 so in the left hand side this and this will be cancelled with each other only x will be left and here we will use again in log formula that is log m divided by n is equal to log of m minus log of n so by using this formula in the right hand side it will become log of 3 raised to power 2 minus log of 2 raised to power 3 similarly we will use the same formula in the denominator so it will become log of 2 minus log of 3 and next step we will use this log formula in the numerator so it will become implies x is equal to 
टू विल बी कम हेयर सो इट विल बी कम टू लॉग ऑफ थ्री माइनस थ्री लॉग ऑफ टू डिवाइडेड बाय लॉग ऑफ टू माइनस लॉग ऑफ थ्री नो इन द नेक्स्ट स्टेप we will put the values of log of 3 and log of 2 from log table or by using calculator so it will become implies x is equal to 2 and the value of log of 3 is 0.4771 minus 3 and the value of log of 2 is 0.3010 similarly we will also put the values of log of 2 and log of 3 here so the value of log of 2 is 0.3010 minus value of log of 3 is 0.4771 now we will further simplify this number here so it will become x is equal to 2 time 1 2 time 1 is 2 2 time 7 is 14 4 1 carry 2 time 7 is 14 14 plus 1 15 5 1 carry and 2 time 4 is 8 8 plus 1 9 point and 0 minus 3 time 0 is 0 3 time 1 is 3 3 time 0 is 0 and 3 time 3 is 9 0.9030 and as we will subtract this result so it will become 1 minus 0 is 1 7 minus 1 is 6 7 minus 0 is 7 and 4 minus 3 is 1 we will put point here and also zero here and also a negative sign here because the subtraction is reverse so in the next step it will become x is equal to We will subtract the result in the numerator. So two minus zero gives him two. Four minus three is one. Five minus zero is five, and nine minus nine is zero. Put the decimal point here, and also zero here, and also minus zero point one seven six one. So by dividing further to by negative gives him negative. So it will become. 0.0512 divided by 0.1761. Now, in the next step, we will divide this numerator by this denominator. So, to divide these, first we will change this divisor to a whole number. So, there are four digit in the denominator. So, we will multiply both the numbers by 10,000. So, it will become x is equal to 0 minus 0.0512 multiply 10000 similarly multiply denominator with 10000 so 0.1761 multiply 10000 by multiply 10000 with this number the point from here will be shift to four digits to the right hand side so it will become x is equal to it will become 512 and also multiplying 10 to 10000 with this number the point will be jump from here to here so it will become 1761 and by dividing this numerator by this denominator we will get minus 0.2896 so x is equal to minus 0.2896 is the answer and the root of this nice exponential math problem